Welcome to TOC Today, the television show of the Outreach Center in Morganton. In this edition, you'll hear about how renting a Penske truck can be very rewarding. Also, a student in the Fresh Start Education Center shares how it has impacted his life. A happy customer talks about why you should be shopping at the New to You thrift store. You'll also hear from some of the area ministries that are spending part of their summer volunteering at the Outreach Center. And speaking of volunteers, you'll hear from some of the Outreach Center most dedicated. Welcome to TOC Today, the television show of the Outreach Center here in Morganton, North Carolina. I'm Holly Johnson, the CEO of the Outreach Center. We're so glad that you're watching us today. And just to tell you again a little bit about what the Outreach Center is about, we assist those who are less fortunate to help them rise above their circumstances and to improve their quality of life. And we do this by providing groceries to between 700 and 1,000 families each week. We also serve some 50 or 60 other organizations to provide them with food and other hygiene items to help them further their missions. We also provide educational services, including GED, job skills classes, resume writing, and other things that can help people to get back on their feet, to help them gain the skills that they need, and to help them have a better life. All of the things that we do here at the Outreach Center would not be possible without our wonderful volunteers. We desire that every dollar that's donated go to services to help those who are in need. So it's really important that we have volunteers to accomplish all of the tasks that we do here at the Outreach Center. Without our volunteers, none of this would be possible. I've been I've been volunteering about 11 years, and and I've been been coming, and I, I've seen people that really have had a need, and it felt good because there was some that really needed it, and you were there to be a part of what they need, and there was some come down that discouraged and and really don't have nobody to talk to, and I love to be available to talk to people. That's one thing about volunteering, you. you you, you can always stop and encourage somebody or talk to somebody. And we found out that everybody do it. All the people volunteer here find somebody they can talk to and help or encourage. Not just me. I'm not the only one. You know, everybody just come in and catch on to what we're doing. We're not only distributing food. So they catch on to we distribute everything you know, that we can. Even a hug and love. You know, and it, it's good to see people smile. See, good to see people that's encouraged. Some folks just come every week just to talk, just to hug, just to be smiled. And they say, I look forward to it. It's, it's been a blessing to me, you know, to sacrifice this time for the Lord to use me. Not only in just one way, but in every way. Even loving one another. It's been encouraging. And we always try to look out for one another, do for one another, help one another. It's good. I like teamwork. I like it when, when everybody working together, everybody seems to be happy about it. It makes it go so good and so sweet. It's a place that people are loved and its purpose is to help people in need that if they need food or many other things that they help them with that they can come here and there's loving people here to pray with them and, and to minister to them for their needs, both physical and spiritual. What I do is pray with people. <laughs> When they come in for groceries, we ask them if they need prayer for anything. And, and many times uh, they are people that are not in churches. They're not in with a place where they can find someone to pray with them. And they just need, they just need that knowing that God cares about them, that He is there for them. We just ordinarily pray for them to know God better, just to draw closer to Him and to know how much he really cares for them and that this is one place that we try to show that, just how much God cares for them on trying to help them in their needs. I think it's a place that really helps people that need it because there's a lot of people, especially my age, that draws a small income and if it wasn't for the outreach, we wouldn't have too, too much to eat because we have all kind of bills and. We also have medications to buy and doctor bills. And, and it's just rough that when you get up to be elderly. They are pretty much help when you don't have any other help. When you think you're down to your last piece of bread, 
you come here and you can get a whole loaf and don't have to worry about it. You got so many people that's nice and pretty much they help you out and just do whatever they can do for you. So it's very much appreciated. I think it's a wonderful program and uh, I think it's very kind of them to help people and uh, families out. Uh, so many people are uh, in need, uh, needing help, and yeah. uh, we greatly appreciate it ourselves. They've been a true blessing. They've, they've helped with even diapers for our grandchildren. They've done a, done a lot of things that they, just, they need all the donations that they can get, for sure. Um, I have twins. I have two little boys, and they just turned two. And um, right now, we're not receiving any help from their father, so the Outreach Center really helps us get through the week. Um, I like the volunteers here. I like um, sitting down and doing a prayer and, uh, and receiving the, need, the grocery items that we need for the week. We're always in need of volunteers here at the Outreach Center. We would love to have you come and help us. You can give us a call at 828-439-8300. You can just show up. We'll give you more information. There's just a simple application for you to fill out, but we have a need in many areas and we would love to have you come and serve with us, especially for the event that's coming up on August 15th, which is our back to school bash. We'll be providing back to school supplies and backpacks to over 800 children. We partner each year with the United Way and with Walmart to be able to do this event. It's a wonderful event. It provides hope and supplies to kids who are in need. And we'd love to have you come be a part of this event. Come and volunteer. We need help with registration. We need help with serving food. We need help prior to the event with packing backpacks. So we'd love to have you come and be a part of this great event. If you know of a child in need, you can go to our website at theoutreachcenter.org and there's a place where you can register your child to pick up a backpack and supplies on the 15th. You can also call us at 828-439-8300 if you would like to volunteer or if you know someone in need of a backpack. You're watching TOC Today, the television ministry of the Outreach Center here in Morganton. I mentioned earlier some of the other organizations that we provide food and hygiene items to, and one of those organizations is South Caldwell Christian Ministries. We have come together in 1982 uh, by local ministers and concerned citizens to form a, a central place for people to come together and, and find whatever assistance it was that they needed. In 1983, we gained our nonprofit status and we started out in a little storefront downtown Granite Falls on Main Street. From there it grew and we purchased a, a house and used that, then we added on to the house. And then in 2003, we moved to our current location, which is a, a 200 by 50 foot metal building, which we thought we would never grow into and we have already outgrown and are currently in the process of building a uh, 50 by 100 square foot food pantry. The Outreach Center in Morganton is a, is a real lifesaver. We, we get the bread, we get other foods that they have a, a, an abundance of, things that they may have to move quickly, as in one time last summer, we had three pallets of tomatoes. And, and I pick them up, we use what we can, we store what we can, and then I start calling other places like Bethel's Colony, um, Yokefella, uh, Soup Kitchen. I try to give away or find a home for everything that comes from outreach to us. I, I don't keep it and let it spoil and then throw it away. Uh, that, that's not the spirit of, of what it was given to us in, and I feel obligated to do the best I can to continue the outreach ministry by doing that outreach myself. Just keep supporting outreach, because they support us. One of the newest ways that you can help us here at the Outreach Center is to come and rent a Penske truck. We have a Penske truck rental that's located in our new to you thrift store. You can come, you can rent your truck for all of your needs. We have all sizes of trucks available. And every dollar that you give to renting that truck, a portion of that goes back to the Outreach Center to help those who are in need. Also, if you're moving, when you get finished moving and you have all those items that you don't know what to do with, you don't know where to donate them, you can just leave them on the back of your Penske truck, bring it back to the Outreach Center, and we'll unload it for you and you can donate it. We'll give you a tax credit for that. We'd love to have you come to check out our Penske truck rental, to rent a truck from us, to share it with your friends, and then to leave your donated items on the truck when you finish. In 
In addition to wonderful donations from people who are so generous, one of the ways that we support the work here at the Outreach Center is through our New To You thrift store. We have some great satisfied customers at New To You, and here's a little bit from one of those. Hi, we're here today at New To You Thrift Store with my good friend, Terry McFalls, who is a wonderful supporter of the Outreach Center. Terry, how long have you been shopping with us now? Uh, probably a couple years. A couple of years, and we appreciate that very much. And can you tell the viewers what you find most exciting about coming into our store? Well, I think first of all, you know, when you come into the store, um, it's a very nice approach, you know, with the staff that works there. and. I think that's always in, inviting, you know, when you come into a uh, public store like that. And, uh, you know, when you come into the store, you never know, you know, what new adventures you're going to find. Um, you know, it just depends on, you know, basically what you're looking for from time to time. And then sometimes you may just, it may just be something that you are interested in and you know you weren't looking for that you weren't looking for exactly. that's true exactly how do you feel about our prices terry do you think that uh, you save a lot of money by shopping with us here you can save a lot of money here that's important you know with a lot of people and absolutely. Uh, to be able to have the savings absolutely and how do you feel about the quality of the items we have in the store from you know we we have a lot of pre-owned things but we also have new items as well don't right we? yes and uh, you know some of those you can use from time to time you know that are used items or and, and you know it's nice to be able to yes, get the it, new items it also. is it is and uh, I know that Terry's been an awesome supporter and I know he spreads the word and the best form of advertisement for our store is great loyal customers like Terry and we appreciate you so much thank you very much thank you enjoy shopping here thank you the New To You Thrift Store is also very fortunate to have several volunteer groups donate time at the store this summer via the South Mountain Children's Home. My church, uh, we got a Carswell Memorial Baptist Church, and um, they always do a summer trip every year to South Mountain Baptist Camp. And we just started going there this year, and um, we signed up to go with our youth, and um, we knew it was going to be a mission week and we were excited about that and so when we got there this is i was assigned to go with these kids to the thrift store um we're sorting through the donations that people have brought in and um just putting them in their necessary place and kind of getting rid of things that aren't going to be useful to the store and um the cool thing about this store is that it generates this entire facility so it kind of also provides for you know the food pantry that they do and also um, just everyday products that people need they supply that for people too and we can we can testify to the fact that you put a lot of work into everything that goes into that thrift store you know going through all the stuff that people drop off and and um, whether it's just figuring out if it's worth keeping or figuring out what pile it goes in how much it needs to needs to cost and a lot goes into it even before it gets to the floor. It just generates a whole lot more um, opportunity to serve people and it's a great organization. Today we are working with the new to you thrift store. Uh, the kids here are separating items that were received this morning in a moving van. A lot of this, a lot of it is furniture, old sewing machines, bookshelves. We're working to get them cleaned off and ready to be sold in the thrift store here. Every kid here is from uh, South Mountain Camp. We're all um, coordinated here through South Mountain. Uh, we all are from separate churches and come here one week during the summer to do the mission camp that South Mountain offers. I think it's a really good work. I think New To You does a very great ministry for the area, for Morganton. Um, and I believe South Mountain does a great ministry for the kids, not only helping New to You and the ministries locally, but to help the kids grow in their relationship with God as well. I'm glad to be a part of it. I'm glad to be part of the ministry that God is doing here. I'm glad to be part of the, the work that the church is doing. So many times in so many churches we get stuck on ourselves. And stay and and get stuck on the pew that we sit in or get stuck on the music that we sing rather than being stuck on the people to serve and the God that we serve so I'm glad just to be a part of it and glad just to have a good experience with the guys here
One of the things that we're very proud of here at the Outreach Center is our educational services. We have GED classes that run every morning of the week, and we have some wonderful students, some wonderful volunteers, and a wonderful instructor that helps people to rise above their circumstances to get their education that's so important in today's economy. And here's a little bit from one of those students. My grades in school were improving in the 10th grade, but then I had an altercation where some things happened. I got, I got ill and everything like that, and I had to take medications. Well, I found Fresh Start from a friend. It's a quiet environment. Our teacher deals with us one-on-one, -on -one, and she's a very nice lady, Miss Shewitt is, and she helps us with our work and teaches us to uh, do the best we can. And uh, I'm really thankful and grateful for that. I love school now. I'm learning something every day. By God's grace, I'll learn more. We have a major need right now here at the Outreach Center. Our building is pretty old and we've had some major leaks in our roof. We've been raising money for some time to get the roof replaced and we're really close to our goal. The manufacturer has donated some of the materials that we need and the community has been so wonderful in providing support to reach the goal of replacing this roof. We're down to the last $1,900. If you could help us by supporting us in um, getting our roof replaced. We would love to have your donation. You can donate online at theoutreachcenter.org or you can give us a call at 828-439-8300 or you can mail your donation to P.O. Box 1003, Morganton, North Carolina. We appreciate the community's support and all the wonderful donations that make what we do here at the Outreach Center possible. One of the newest things we have going on here at the Outreach Center is our Penske truck rental. When you need to rent a truck, come down to the Outreach Center and rent a Penske truck because not only does it help you in your move, but it also helps those who are less fortunate. You can support the Outreach Center by renting your Penske truck right here at the New to You Thrift Store at the Outreach Center. Just come to this counter. We're open from 8 to 5, Monday through Saturday. You can reserve your truck by calling the number on the screen. You can go online and do an online reservation, or you can show up here at the Outreach Center at the New to You Thrift Store and come and support the community every time that you need a truck rental. Thanks for watching TOC Today, the television show of the Outreach Center here in Morganton, North Carolina. We need your help. We are dependent on gifts from the community, from individual donations, from business donations, from donations to our thrift store. There are many ways you can help us. We also need you to come and to volunteer. It is critical that we have your support to keep the operations going here at the Outreach Center. It touches so many lives and you can make a difference. You can go to our website at www.theoutreachcenter.org. You can call us at 828-439-8300 or you can mail us your monetary gift at P.O. Box 1003, Morganton, North Carolina. We'd love to have you support us here at the Outreach Center. Come and take a tour. Check out what we're doing. Thanks so much for watching TOC Today.